This is not a pleasant time for any of us in law enforcement. Accusations of bribes and embezzlement within the King City Police Department reaching the highest levels of the force, a corruption case that involved the most vulnerable in society. And these are the people who are really disadvantaged, they're not always English speaking, and they said something that really resonated with me. The police, they are taking our property, they're taking our cars, they take our money, and we can do nothing about that. Monterey County District Attorney Dean Flipple described it as an organized scheme in which those arrested targeted and impounded the cars of Spanish speakers. Investigators say if there was a ringleader, Sergeant Bobby Carrillo was it, impounding dozens of cars and directing the business to Miller's Towing, a tow yard owned by acting chief Bruce Miller's brother. For every 10 to 15 vehicles that were impounded by Sergeant Carrillo, he would receive a free vehicle for himself or whatever he wanted to do with it. One of the five cars that Sergeant Carrillo had received free out of all of those impounds that he had done, Captain Miller accepted that car. That's Captain Miller who would become acting chief after Nick Baldivius retired. Both implicated along with four officers in the free Cars for Cops scheme. Flippo said hundreds of cars changed hands and possibly sold for thousands of dollars by the officers. Flippo said those arrested dishonored their badge and the case he said highlighted the lack of leadership in the department. The citizens of King City deserve better than what they have been receiving. And it is my hope that this will be the first step in addressing issues. 